Hello and welcome to Monday Night in the Model Room. Um, what I thought I'd do is on Mondays in August, once I get in the house, I'll put like um, an update on, like a video, um, let you know what's been happening or not happening, <laughs> um, any issues or problems or how we can help me solve. Um, I'll probably do it until about September because I'm quite busy in September and October and then see how it goes, whether I'll pick it back up in the winter or whether you know, you'll be bored of it by then, probably. Um, so yeah, that's the plan. So today I just thought I'd try and answer some of the questions that are coming through. And one of the main, most popular one is about this wall. Um, a lot of people seem to think the layout is against the wall, whether it's because most of the videos from over there, I don't know. but. As you can see, I'm demonstrating there's a little gap here. This is only small, so you do have to breathe in and squeeze your way along. But um, I toyed between sort of putting this gap here or putting like an access area. I know some people like to pop up in the middle, don't they? So they can do maintenance or the landscaping from there. But I, I thought I'd prefer to have this sort of access route here and to keep that to landscaping in the middle there. So just my personal preference. Um, so yeah, main question, um, <laughs> I'm all in the gap. <laughs> but um, the next one is about size. Um, people wanna know how big is it? Well, as I've mentioned in the previous videos, I don't know if you've all seen that, there is a double bed under here. So that tells you it's the width of a double bed. Um, it's not a king or anything like that, just like a standard little bed. Um, which I have left some room down by the window where it can pull out, probably about like so. So from there upwards you could be free of the layout. Um, but I haven't had any guests want to stay since this has been down. Uh, I would probably let them have my room and I'd sleep in here, but whether they think hmm, she wouldn't, <laughs> I don't know. But they seem to prefer a taxi these days. So. If you, if you don't want guests, this is what you do. <laughs> but, um, so, length, it's really long, um, as probably shows on some of the videos. I, I did it in a maximum length of that wall, and nearly all the way down, as I'm told, as far as I've just said. Um, so, that possibly makes it look a little bit more, I don't know, pinched in, not as wide as it actually is, if you would see it in the flesh. But, um, I'm not sure but so yeah I'll, I'll perhaps get the exact measurements I just build it to fill, fill the room really as big a thing as, as possible but um, I'll perhaps get the exact measurements that might be a better idea um, uh, the other questions is what's happening after Leversham well I'm not sure if anyone saw the first video but um, Leversham will kind of move on goes to the MPD in the corner there um, we've got that nice building I showed the other week, uh, which hopefully is quite similar to the MPD. Around the corner to Golfland, which you saw the other week. Um, Golfland then carries on to Deal Squat, um, which I don't know if any of you watch Clarkson's Farm, but I quite like it, and that's my take on Diddly Squat. So I just thought it would be a nice little addition. Um, plays with my imagination a little bit. So, uh, more yeah one more um a couple of people want to know what my plans are for the middle um well originally i was thinking get some height because it's quite flat uh, the tracks are flat landscape hasn't got too much height to it so I, I i don't know it's all up here at the moment there's a lot goes on up here um which doesn't always compute <laughs> but I, I think i've got time to think about that because obviously i've got quite a bit still to be going on so um, that's work in progress which I've shown you can't wish a good job um, so that might be in a year's time <laughs> maybe depends on how many more holidays I book but um, anyway thank you for showing an interest thanks to people who, who have the questions and that and genuinely interested um, so hopefully I'll be back next week with another update so thank you for tuning in